please, you build new home here at Drula. So we have the honor to have our uh, DG and uh, Sam, and they will be assisted by Thelma to have our ceremonial labor. So please. Right. Well, no, I think what we, what we do is that you and I cut and tell Everybody the Everybody cut the yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because we could step up so that there will be more people inside the house. Wait, no. running around. Facility. 
I, um, I was immediately distracted by the GPS and the iPad there. <laughs> Wondering if maybe I could come in some weekend and make a, a swap with a dummy that I can get over in Green Hills. Uh, but at any rate, it's a. Uh, I think it's really great that that this um, uh, that, see, that uh, the social sciences division, which has been growing so much, finally has enough space uh, in order to uh, to work uh, with some degree of comfort. Uh, before you were a bit shoehorned in over uh, in, 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 uh, on the other side of the road and uh, with the friction and squeezing with the plant breeders, etc. Et uh, you know, just were making life uh, awfully constrained. But one thing I have to say, and I've talked to Sam about this, that, that uh, one of the, I think, tremendous strengths of uh, Erie has been a very strong commitment to social sciences. Right from the very beginning, Randy Barker, uh, then Bob Hurt, and John Flynn, and many, many great, uh, I, uh, Dr. Hayami, many of the greats in, in agricultural economics spent many, many years here and helped, in fact, uh, incorporate and mainstream the concept of social sciences into agricultural research for development and in fact the concept of research for development and how that's measured how that's quantified i think can be traced right back here to, to erie so there's a tremendous uh, history and tradition of major accomplish accomplishments of social sciences and major influence of the social sciences uh, at, at erie the secret i think to that has been the integration of social sciences with the other disciplines in the Institute. And so while you were shoehorned in over across the road, it also made sure there was lots of physical contact, maybe too much physical contact, but lots of physical contact among the different disciplines and, and, and social sciences was embedded in that. And so while I think it's, it's great that there is this uh, expansion of area that can allow social sciences to continue to grow, I think it's critically important that you work, make an extra effort to retain and even further the integration of the other disciplines. And I think that uh, if you are able to, to achieve a certain degree of physical comfort in these new facilities, I trust that there will be even more incentive to integrate with other disciplines. So that's uh, my message today is that uh, congratulations on having a new home, or I'm sorry, having a new house. <laughs> but don't forget that a home includes not only the structure that you live in, but the people you interact with. And I trust that that interaction will be, and your home will continue to be, all across the research community of hearing. So with that, congratulations, welcome home, and thank you. And you will notice on our shirts, because you were mentioning about integrations, bridging the gaps in dry sciences, that's how SSD works. Before we, before we ask everyone to do a, a tour of the different facilities that we have and also our respective offices, which you have to make sure to visit because we clean them <laughs> in the last uh, three hours. <laughs> Um, Jean Hetel here um, gave us a gift uh, two days ago. He was trying to capture all what happened during the start of the renovation, and he came up with a two, two and a half minutes uh, summary of uh, the renovation that took place since last last year. And we'd like to show them to everyone. Look at our on our screen. Yeah. 